Do you want to start? <laughs> hey, welcome everybody to Main Street Live. <laughs> Who are you? I'm Mike. I'm Teresa. I'm the Main Street Director at Main Street Amherst. All right. So here we are. Happy New Year, everyone. Yep. First video of the year. And so we're here to talk about a couple different things that are happening with Main Street Amherst. And the first thing is happening tomorrow. And it's not too late if you would like to come. It is our Smart Start Workshop tomorrow morning from 8.30 to 10. Yep. Uh, Kevin from Avery Solutions is going to be our uh, presenter tomorrow. And it's going to be going over uh, YouTube, how to start a YouTube channel, um, and kind of have a, a following that way to help build your brand. Yeah. So if you're a Main Street member, it's $5. And if you're not a member, you still can come and it's $15. And if you have a laptop or an iPad or something, bring it with you. Make sure that you have a Gmail account already all set up, Kevin yeah. said. That way you can walk right through the process with your, if you don't have a laptop or anything, you don't have to have one. But if you'd like to bring one, please do. Yeah, I so think it would be easier if you have a Gmail account and a laptop with you. Uh, this way you can do some hands-on stuff as he's going over it. And this is actually the second time that we're doing this because the first time I think all of us were so overwhelmed because right. there's just so much information about YouTube that I didn't even I didn't even know about. So <laughs> it's it's really a great class. So it's not too late to sign up. You can sign up and pay through our Facebook page or not Facebook, our website, MainStreetAmers.org, or you can just bring the money tomorrow. Yep. We have a light breakfast that we'll be serving tomorrow as well. So what's next after that? Uh, after that, it is the uh, Amherst Comedy Night. Um, that's hosted at the Amherst Cinema uh, as well. This year we have Liz Blanc starting the night off. Uh, followed by Mary Santora. Um, our host is going to be um, Chris Harvey. He was one of the comics from last year. We're bringing him back to MC, and then he's going to have a, uh, a good uh, set as well. And then the headliner is Mike Polk Jr. Um, so if you're unfamiliar with any of those, if you go to our Facebook page, it has links to all of their websites, so you can kind of get a little preview. That would um, be the event page. The event page. Which is, which is called what? Uh, I think it's Amherst Comedy Night 2019. 2019. I believe. Yeah. So look up the event and all the information is on there. It yep. is thirty dollars per person. You get um, a drink with your ticket and a thing of popcorn. And this year you're going to either be able to have beer or wine. Right. So we spruce it up a little bit. Um, getting rid of the wine coolers, going more wine and mm -hmm. maybe a, a higher end beer as well. Yeah, absolutely. Um, so what, what are you going to say about that? What do you um, have? Tickets you say online and whatnot. Um, you can buy them online. You can buy them from several dis different businesses uh, in the downtown area. All the board members have tickets as well. Okay. Um, Main Street Office has them as well. Yep. So, and we will only sell 300 tickets. Yes. So we want to thank the Costello family for allowing us to um, host the uh, the event in their cinema. So it's so very kind of them, and it's just so nice to be able to do something right here. So you don't have to drive all the way down to Cleveland to see a comedy show. You can see it right here in our hometown. And I think it's actually cheaper than going to Cleveland. Oh, yeah. Plus, you get a drink and some popcorn. Yeah, you don't have to pay, pay for parking. Right, um, absolutely. Yeah, you stop down, go to Ziggy's or Brew Kettle, or I heard Barra might be open by then. I think they um, are. I'm hoping. Yeah, so stop down and get a bite to eat before and after. And so, again, the comedy show is Saturday, March the 9th. And doors open at 7, show begins at 8, yep. $30 um, a person. So buy your ticket quickly because, again, it's only 300 people can um, actually see this great show. So I'm really excited because we have two women this year. We've never had yeah. um, women comics, so I'm excited to see them. And it's all new lineup except for Chris, who's our MC. But um, he was a surprise visitor last year, so we didn't even know he was coming. Yeah, he, he was, was a big hit. He was really so. funny. So I'm looking forward to that night. What else do we have coming up? I'm going to mention something that um, Joni put out there. Joni yes. is our promotional chair, and we are going to do a new event this year, and it's Basket Bingo. So look for more information on our Facebook page and our website. We are checking out a venue. Um, it's going to be in April. I don't want to say the date until we have the venue secured, but um, it seems like we have a lot of people that um, are interested in that. So. I want to go. I've never been to bingo. So well, I, I've I really been to want bingo, to but I've never been to a basket bingo. So um, it'll be all new for us, and I think that is something that we're missing here in Amherst. We don't have it anymore. I used to have bingo at St. Joe's. The schools used to have it. And nobody really has it too much anymore. So it should be a fun. It'll be a Sunday afternoon, is what it'll be. So yeah. um, watch for more information. And our next general meeting is Thursday, February seventh. Everybody's welcome. It's at nine o'clock in the Main Street building at two five five Park Avenue. Only lasts not even an hour sometimes. No, no, not even an hour. But you get to find out what's happening. And we also allow the people that attend to say anything at the end of the meeting if they'd like to say something about their business. So yeah. it's a great opportunity to network. And we're definitely looking for some new ideas for new events that we can have. So 
Um, you can message us on Facebook here, uh, or you can come to the meetings and mention it yeah. during that open session as well. Absolutely. Um, love to hear your ideas. Yeah, that would be a great thing. Yeah. Yep, the more the merrier. <laughs> <laughs> all right, I think that's all we have for today. That's all? Yeah, I think, that, unless you, did you have nope. something you want to, are you sure? I'm good. Are you positive? More Wait, positive. I want to ask him a question. Oh, no. So, was Santa good to you? Yes. Are you sure? Yes. You were that good this past year? Yeah. Really? He was really good to the kids, so they had a great Christmas. To the kids? He was yes. good to the kids? Yeah. I'm not talking about the kids, I'm talking about you. I know. Well, <laughs> Okay, that's. I just wanted to ask if Santa was good to him. I don't think he was good to the kids because the kids are, the kids are perfect. So of course. Sure. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, everybody have a great day and stay warm. It's um, snowing out there. It's such a big difference from yesterday. Right. So stay safe, stay warm, and we'll see you next week. All right, see ya. Bye.